Good morning, Hero Wars fans. In this video, I will discuss the procedure for summoning Chorus and leveling up his equipment. First, the procedure for summoning Chorus is explained. In this event, only one procedure exists to summon Chorus. On the Raven's Vault screen, the Pet Evolution button on the right side of the screen is the only button that can summon Chorus or level up Chorus Star. This is because the Raven Horde does not contain the Soul Stones needed to level up Chorus. Therefore, the only option to obtain Chorus Soul Stone is to use Freed Souls and press Pet's Evolution button. Well, here is the main point of this video, or rather, the explanation of the peculiarities of this Chorus Birth event. First, I invite you to view the play screen of the Biscuit implementation event that took place when Biscuit was created in 2021. There are two types of stones needed to level up Biscuit equipment, the Dawn Stone and the Sun Stone. It was also possible to level up Biscuit stars and Biscuit's equipment using the resources received during the Biscuit Birth event. However, for this Chorus Birth event, the stones needed to level up Chorus equipment are not sold at all at Raven's Vault. You are such a bad liar, do you think you are making a joke? This image shows the list of products available in Raven's Vault, and this image shows the stones needed to level up Chorus equipment. And this is what happens when you put together the two types of materials I just showed you. Well, what are your thoughts on this material? I have wondered if I have misunderstood something or created the wrong material when I prepared this material. However, no matter how many times I review the material, I find no errors in this material. Could this be a trap set by the management of Hero Wars to encourage game users to pay? In other words, if you summon Chorus during this event and you do not have Duskstone and Nightstone in your inventory, the only way to level up Chorus equipment is to purchase those stones using Chaos Particles. Here is an image of the portal charges I had stockpiled in my in-game email. To put it bluntly, even 9 raids on Adventure Map 12 with 9 portal charges may not be enough to get Chorus up to purple equipment during this event. If I could have obtained the Dusk Stone and Night Stone needed for Chorus equipment at Raven's Vault, I could have leveled up Chorus equipment to purple. However, the use of Chaos Particles to obtain pet equipment stones is not very cost-effective. Therefore, I have decided to concentrate on raising the level of Chorus Star at this Chorus Birth event. So how do you collect the Dusk Stone and Night Stone needed for Chorus equipment? I plan to get those two types of stones at the next pet event, the Great Storm. This material is a group of products that are available in the Great Storm Shop. The Great Storm Shop sells all five types of stones needed to level up pets' equipment, and I plan to get the Dust Stone and Night Stone for Chorus's equipment at the Great Storm Shop. Well, I had to chuckle when I saw Hero Wars Management's blatant Emerald Sales strategy at this event, ha! Huh? Well, Hero Wars is a business for the management and a game for us, so this kind of system will be a win-win situation for both parties. What I can say at the moment is that after summoning Chorus with one star, you should just verify Chorus ability in the Hero Challenge, and based on the results, decide whether you want to train Chorus or not. By the way, this image shows the quantity of Chaos Particles and Emeralds required to level up Chorus to blue or purple equipment. You can see how expensive it is to obtain stones for equipment using Chaos Particles. Kenru would like to ask a favor of you who have watched the video to this point. If this video made you laugh and feel happy, Please share the URL link to this video with your guildmates in your guild. Thank you for watching the video until the last part. I'll see you in my next video.